Now, this is a song that I've never sung in public before, and I've wanted to for a long time. <clears throat> but uh, I loved what Alexander was started to talk about. Um, you know, it's been on my mind a lot. I just had my 60th birthday, and um, you know, there's a lot of us that have it, that that have been living this life for a long, long time when we've we've seen a lot of our friends go. I mean, I from the time I was like 20 to the time I was 30, I probably buried 150 people I knew well, closely. Lost a generation of people. And um, the other day I got contacted on Facebook. I, I put up this Facebook post about an old friend of mine named Michael Katz who was one of the very first people I knew to pass of AIDS in the early 80s. And he was an AIDS activist. He had done this very famous play called AIDS Us. I was very impressed because Barbara Streisand came to his play. I thought, wow, how cool Barbara Streisand's in your play. And, um, and in the last days of his life, I said to him, is there anything I can do for you that would matter to you? And he said, remember my name. And I put a post up about that just randomly about two months ago. And there's this um, Instagram page called the AIDS Memorial that I had not known anything about. But he contacted me and said, can I replay your post? It was so touching. Can I put it on my page? And I said, sure. Within t like four hours, it had like 3,000 hits and all these amazing comments of people just pouring out their love and memories of their people and everybody's like, we're remembering Michael's name in Boston. We're remembering Michael's name in Italy. We're, Michael Katz, Michael Katz. It was so touching. So um, by, by strange coincidence, earlier in the year, I, I, I do a podcast called Cabarabia, and one of the people I interviewed is the very brilliant songwriter Marsha Malaman. She's written a lot of things that Barbara Streisand's recorded, Chaka Khan, um, Luther Vandross, a bunch of people. But she was the co-writer of the song I'm about to sing with Peter Allen and Michael Callan, which became sort of the AIDS anthem of the 80s. And uh, she herself is, is ill right now with Lyme disease. And there's a big treatment that's very hopeful, so we're going to have a big benefit for her at Catalina soon, and, and you know, a roster of stars are agreeing to be in it. And um, so I dedicate this to Marsha. <clears throat> Always play a part instead of being who you really are, then you might just miss the one who's standing there. So instead of passing by, show that someone that you care. Instead of asking why, why me and why you? Oh, we have. 
Riverdale.